Welcome back from Graphic Extras. In this tutorial, I'm just going to show you how to create a pattern design with transparency. I'm going to use in this particular tutorial a PDF document, one from Graphic Extras, that's my designs. And I'm just going to go to File, Place, and there's a selection of different designs. Uh, just select one of them. Just go for that one. Click OK, import, resize the design. I don't want it to be actually touching the edge. Obviously, with a pattern, you don't actually want it to you want it to be seamless design, so you avoid the edges. That's the key thing. Now you've got actually got this design. Say you want to recolor the design, you think, oh, okay, just go recolor it. You can't, you can't recolor it. Quick way around that. I always find very easy way and also somehow actually work makes the layer work slightly better is actually just go to duplicate layer let's quickly duplicate and you'll see you've got two layers now just select those and that's in the layers palette if you haven't got the layers palette window layers and merge layers right so if actually it looks actually the same exactly identical Go over now to image adjustments and now you can actually recolor it so you want to say color that design it's a weird quirk feature but uh, some weird reason that seems to work click ok and now to actually get rid of the background so you just do delete just delete there or you could just use that now you've actually got a design you can of course you can add additional paths to it designs to it as well you can of course modify the area but I'm just going to go with a very basic design so there you are you've got that design of course you could save it as a PNG file if you wish and then you can obviously bring it in later but another option define pattern via the edit menu define pattern and you'll see it's got transparency so click OK now I'm just going to get rid of that layer new fill layer pattern click OK and you will actually see the design there and I can now go 25 so you can actually see the pattern of course as it's got transparency you can actually th see through the design so I can actually create a new fill a layer pattern click OK and again I put that to 25 I actually prefer to keep them separate I actually like to have self duplicate and you can move reposition those blocks and there you have it of course you can combine that or go layer flatten image anyway i hope you found this tutorial of interest and you'll subscribe to the graphic extras channel always adding tutorials every couple of days thank you much